Hi everybody and welcome back to Relax My Dog. Now today's video is quite an interesting one because we are going to be talking about whether you should put clothes on your dog. This is quite a topic of discussion because a lot of people think it's absolutely fine to put clothes on your dog whereas other people think it is completely against the rules and they think it is part of animal cruelty but we're going to be talking about whether it is right for your dog whether some breeds actually need to wear clothes and things like that do let me know your opinion down below in the comments remember that is a nice communal place down below so don't be being very, very mean in the comments because it's just not really needed but do let me know down below what are your thoughts on dogs wearing clothes <coughs> Now I think the main reason that this is such a big topic of discussion is because buying your dog clothes is extremely popular, it is very very common even just for sort of the comedic factor of your dog is wearing clothes that are maybe similar to your own clothes or that it's just funny and um, like around Halloween we normally put clothes on our dog even if it's just something simple as a collar, Milo wears a scarf on his collar it doesn't put him in any distress at all but it's just cute to watch him and to see him wearing a little scarf on his collar but I think the main reason that people are so either really interested in it or don't like it at all is because it is available in pretty much any mainstream store and obviously sometimes these are functional pieces of clothing like a collar and other things are just fashionable and things that you might just want to have a bit of a laugh and a joke with your dog so the first thing I want to make perfectly clear is that dogs do not care about fashion so if they seem stressed out or in distress or uncomfortable then just don't put them through that it is a very very stressful situation obviously for your dog especially if they are going from never wearing a piece of clothing in their life to all of a sudden wearing a three-piece suit it's just not comfortable for your dog I remember there should be no yelling you should never get frustrated with your dog and you absolutely shouldn't be punishing them for if they are not enjoying wearing the clothing it's just that is when it sort of crosses the line into animal cruelty. So like I said, if you are wanting to make your dog wear clothes, definitely do start off with something small, like a lightweight t-shirt, just for them to get used to sort of wearing something on their body, because obviously it's not necessarily natural for a dog to be wearing a piece of clothing. There can be reasons other than this in terms of breed like a chihuahua, they get extremely cold in really, really cold weathers. They aren't used to it, their breed isn't used to it. And so they tend to shake or shake shiver you'll sort of see a chihuahua they do sort of have a bit of a tremor about them and that can sometimes just be because they are cold and that's why they their owners might opt to put a coat or a water jumper on them in the winter months as well as this a lot of people may use it after their dog has been neutered this is actually quite a common way to stop your dog from getting near their stitches if you put something on their body as opposed to just on their head like normal people would do obviously if your dog goes to the vets and gets neutered they normally get a cone on just to stop them from picking out the stitches where you can actually pop a piece of clothing on your dog to stop them from getting to the stitches but it does mean that their their wound is sort of covered up which can actually mean that it takes longer to heal etc but it does mean that they won't get access to it if they start to freeze they stand still they look like they have been covered in glue and they can't move this is just when you should take the clothing off your dog straight away they is causing them too much stress and they are just not enjoying it at all but that is it for this week's video thank you all so so much for watching don't forget to follow us over on our social medias we are on instagram facebook and also twitter also don't forget to give this video a big, big thumbs up if you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe to our channel by clicking the button in the middle here and also don't forget to check out our previous video which is all the way on the other side of the screen if you would like to learn more and more about your dog thank you all so so much for watching and me and milo we'll see you next week for next week's video Bye.